grab you by the scruff of the neck. I am Charles Maud. And throw you out. I'm the bartender. I am Ursula's father. I'm a rock star, kind of Elvis sort of person in the 50s. But these Park Tudor playwrights are also key contributors to the Panthers basketball team. Get out. Other than like the you know the small like jokes about uh, us being in the musical, they're they're very supportive. I play power forward. I've been fortunate enough to be probably a sixth or seventh man on the basketball team. And Saturday, Cameron Wallen, Reggie Nesbitt, and Trey Fazenfeld participated in a once-in-a-lifetime triple header of sorts. You see, the school's performance of Bye Bye Birdie coincided with IHSAA Regional Saturday. And when Park Tudor beat South Ripley in a morning semifinal, the players drove 75 miles from Connorsville back to Indianapolis for the 3 o'clock opening act. Right when the buzzer went off, I was like, all right, now it's time to be Conrad. They traded high tops for dress socks and quickly shined under an altogether different kind of spotlight. It's not like the show could have gone on without them. One of the basketball stars played Conrad Birdie, the musical's lead actor. I hope I never get that tense. He's taking a huge role in like responsibility, you know, making sure he has all the lines and all the songs and moves memorized. It's really fun for me just to be able to you know, get in front of people and kind of perform. And when the performers came out for their final recognition, the mission was only two-thirds finished. Birdie quickly became Trey. As soon as the play was over, I knew I had to uh, get in the mindset for winning a regional. Time for a trip back to Connorsville. And back at the Spartan Bowl. Got back about uh, 10 minutes before we could take the floor to play. It was Reggie Nesbitt's turn to take a starring role. Reggie was great. He got every loose ball, he rebounded, he played post defense. And Park Tudor won a regional championship for the first time since 2001. My dedication to the team first, because that, that started off first. So I'm just happy that we got this oh. regional championship. A day to remember. One curtain call and one net cutting celebration. What is a better feeling, taking that final bow or cutting down that net up there? They're both equally great, and I'm just, I'm just so excited that I was able to know what both feel like. And that is the stuff movies are made of. Wow. Wow. Those are my thoughts. Wow. In summary, those three Park Tudor Panthers contributed towards two basketball victories and three performances of Bye Bye Birdie in less than 48 hours. Thus, this weekend should be a walk in the park. Just one game, but it is important. The Seymour Semi-State Championship, Saturday night. Jeremiah Johnson, IndieSportsNation.com.